All right, here at Fan Expo, uh, very great artist. We're uh, really pleased to meet Lee Weeks. How are you doing, sir? Good, thanks. Um, I wanted to ask you about your influences as a kid and how you got started into animation and drawing. Uh, my first influence was actually an older brother who drew all the time and did whatever that brother was involved in. My brother Eric, I, I wanted to do because I wanted to be him and not me. And uh, artistically, I, professionally, the the first and still one of the biggest influences in, in my drawing style and approach is, was the great John Buscema, who drew everything for Marvel. And, but there have been so many others, Joe Kubert, Al Williamson, Alex Toth, um, later guys like Frank Miller, David Mazzucchelli, but so many, Gene Colan, older guys, Steve Ditko, Neil Adams. You brought up Frank Miller. What yeah. makes Frank so special to the comic book world? Well, I think what Frank did, I mean, he did many things, but he brought a, for me, the way I see it, the way I understand it, um, a, a little bit more of an intimate storytelling style, a, a very cinematic style. And then obviously tone-wise, he, he, he changed things and brought a, a, a darker tone, a grittier tone to things. And that certainly uh, was impactful for me at, at that age. Who are some of the characters that you've worked with? Oh, the, the one I'm probably most known for is Daredevil, but I've worked on just about everybody. Most of the X-Men characters, Spider-Man, Hulk, Captain America, Captain Marvel, Superman, Batman. What do you think about the, the death of Wolverine coming up? What do you think about that whole idea? I didn't know he was dying. Yeah, it's, it's, that's it. That's oh a wrap for the wolf. Oh my goodness. No, I don't know anything about it. Are you, are you joking? No. I don't know anything about it. I'm, I'm pretty disconnected with, what, with oh, what's going okay. on in the story. Well, line. they have the, the, you know, since you've worked on Wolverine. Yes, I have. So now they're killing off the character. Really? This month. Really? September is the last <laughs> month of Wolverine. What do you think of that? I, well, I've been, I, I have to say, several months ago, I started working over at DC. So I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just, I didn't even know that was happening. I don't know what to think. Um, I'm sure he'll be coming back. Yeah. I think Hugh Jackman's not going to be very happy. Working on Daredevil, which you're, you're most famous for, what about that character that drew you to him? Pathos. Most of the characters I'm really interested in, there's an element of pathos that just I'm drawn to. Almost a melancholy, but a hopeful sincerity. You know, that, he, that he, he's definitely a flawed individual, but he has a heart to, to do what's right. And, um, also fascinated from a very early time, going back 25 with the with the uh, religious element, the, the Christian element that Frank introduced. I actually wrote a Daredevil project last year, wrote and drew, and that was a, an element, a theme that I I relied on pretty heavily in that story. So, all right, my friend. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, Kwame. I'm Lee Weeks, and you're watching Comics Asylum.